Egypt's president made the country's intentions plain last week at the UN General Assembly in New York. As you know, Egypt is a founding member of the UN and has always been a strong participant in achieving its goals, especially maintaining peace and development. Therefore, I request member states to support Egypt's candidacy to the membership of the Security Council. Aside from the Security Council's five permanent members, ten seats rotate every two years and are geographically distributed. The non-permanent members are chosen by vote in the General Assembly and at the Security Council. Foreign Minister Sameh Shukri says he has been lobbying member states for support. But why now? Egypt has been absent for three years for internal reasons, and states with hostile intentions were trying to fill the void. We can see the results, the spread of terrorism around us. Egypt is now sending a message that it is back to its leading role and will work to restore order in the Middle East. In campaigning, Egypt is relying on its history within the UN. It was founding member, it's a consistent contributor to the UN peacekeeping forces, and an Egyptian, Boutros Boutros Ghali, was secretary general from 1992 to 1996. Egypt has always been an active member. It leads numerous initiatives to counter terrorism and nuclear disarmament in the Middle East. As a Security Council member, it will continue to do so. It will also advocate the increase of permanent members at the Council. Egypt should be competing with Senegal for the African seat. If elected, it will be the fifth time, the most in Africa and the Middle East. It will also mean international recognition of the path that Egypt is undertaking. Yasser Hakim for CCTV, Cairo.